everyone. I wanted to do a video today about the Perfectly Matte Lipsticks in Campaign 5. They are brand new starting in Campaign 5. They're $5.99 each. There are 12 colors, 12 beautiful colors, highly pigmented. Uh, they're weightless. They are non-drying. Uh, that being said, if your lips tend to be a little bit dry, um, make sure the last couple of days I've done this because I've been getting sick or whatnot, but on uh, the last couple of days I've put chapstick on about five, waited about five minutes and then put the lipstick on over it. Uh, there's also um, home remedies for coconut sugar scrubs that you can use on your lips before you apply the uh, lipstick. With matte lipsticks, if you have a tendency to have dry lips, that's going to really show up. So you want to either wear chapstick or exfoliate, okay? All right, we're going to start with the first color. It is Perfectly Nude. Perfectly Nude. Let's see how I can put this on. I do not have a lip liner on, sorry. So I'm putting it on without a lip liner. And I do not have chapstick on. Perfectly nude. It is a uh, very nude, very neutral lipstick. Okay. Let's see if I can take that off. Okay. The next one I'm going to try is Marvelous Mocha. Marvelous Mocha. I thought this one was very pretty as well. If you like browns, you will like Marvelous Mocha. Just trying to let you see it. So I'm trying to get a little close to the camera. Okay. Try another one. Oh, one of my favorites that I've been using a lot. It's called Pure Pink. Mm, it's almost like a nude, but it has a pink color to it, so it's not real bright. So it's a little bit of a muted pink, but very, very pretty. I really liked it. See, still a pink color, a little bit muted, not um, bright, because we've got some bright ones coming up. So that is pure pink. Love this color. Okay. Okay. Ideal lilac. I love this color. So far, I've been saying I love all the colors, but this one I really do. Oh, let's see if I can get this on. Hoping that you can see the colors. Ideal Lilac. Ideal Lilac. So, yeah, love that as well. Okay. Let's see if I can get this one off. I find that they're long wearing too, they last a while on the lips. This one is electric pink. Oh, love electric pink. I think more of a Barbie doll pink. Don't 
don't know if you can see that. Hope the lighting is good where you can see it, where this is doing it justice. Okay. These first ones I wear a lot. The rest of them I don't wear. I haven't tried at all. So I'm going to try to show you what they look like. This one is Adoring Love. Makes me think in between a pink and a red. That's what it makes me think. Don't know if you guys can see that. It's adoring love. It's not really red. It's some, um, for lack of a better word, a reddish pink color. Uh, let me see. I want to try hot plum. Let's try hot plum. I don't wear very many of these colors. If you have a darker skin tone. Might look a little better on you. The colors are just so cool. Mm. Hot plum. I'm kind of digging that though. Hot plum. Hmm. Might have to find something to wear that with. See? Okay. That was hot plum. What is this one? Red Supreme. And I don't wear reds at all, guys. So we're going to see. face that is red supreme let me see if you can see it on a oh. mm. red supreme I can't see in the camera so that's why I'm having to use this mirror um, oh what's this one coral fever I have a lot of customers that love coral lipsticks. I'm not a fan for myself. Let's see if we can. Tell what it looks like. Hmm, we'll see. Coral fever. They feel really nice on not drying like you would think. Real soft. And I'm just using a wet wipe to wipe it off real quick so I can continue. Oh, what's this one? This is so fun. Just use a wild cherry. Now, I'm not really sure what this is going to do, so bear with me. Wild cherry. Let me see if I can get this one on. Yeah, that's a deep, almost like a burgundy. 
that's what it looks like to me anyway. And then this one is Superb Wine. This is going to be a deep color also. Probably be better if I had a lip liner on with it, but you know, you're trying to do it as you go. That's superb wine. Hmm, what do you think? I wear mostly pinks. It's a pretty color though. Huh. And I did have one more. Forgot all about it. The Ravishing Rose. I should have done this one. This is actually the one that I ordered the full size tube in, and then I decided I wanted to try the others. Ravishing Rose. It is, let's see if you can see that on my hand. I'll get it into view there. I'm not good at this, I'm backwards, so. It's um, not really red, but it's a bright pinky red color as well. But I like this color as well. Uh, right now, my favorites are the pure pink and the um, love the hot plum. I love the lilac and the electric pink. Okay, that's it for me right now. Let me know if you're trying all the colors and which ones you love. And let me know how the lipstick feels for you, how you like it, how long it lasts. Uh, for me, it lasts a good long while, um, even through eating and drinking. They are, like I said, smooth going on. If you tend to have a, if you have a tendency to have dry lips, dry skin, you may want to put some chapstick underneath it or do some exfoliating scrub, you know, like the coconut oil and sugar scrub or something like that before you wear it. If not, it's going to show all those dry places on your lips. Okay? All right. Until next time. See you guys. Bye.